Right, I am back out. It's raining again. Um, but hey ho, let's get out there. Let's get on with it. Let's get something. Um, be nice to get some silver. Um, but yeah, let's just try and get some coins. Anyway, I shall see you at the first hole. Let's dig. Well, first sig signal. It's a deep, sketchy, high numbers. Could be rubbish. It could be something really small. Let's go for it. Oh, it's out. Oh, I can see it. There we go. Another penny to add to the collection. Probably going to be something a bit sketchy. 21, 22. I don't know, it could be a... Sounds nice and bright. There we go. Seventies half penny by the looks of it. Yep. Okay, got a solid twenty-three. Usually, I would guess that this would be a pound coin. It'd be nice if it is. Uh, where are you then? Ah, oh, me pinpointer weren't even turned on. Ball top. Well, this wasn't the ring I was looking for. Piece of cut brass pipe. Eh. Oh well. Okay, I've got a solid, pretty much solid ten. Well, nine ten. I can see something there. What have we got? Uh, oh, shotgun cap. Oh well. Oh, okay. It's probably the best signal that I've had that isn't a penny. It was a solid 19. It says it's on the surface. And it's quite small. So. Uh, uh, we have a coin. Uh, we have a 10 cent euro. <laughs> For a second. Mm. Yeah, for a second that had me, because that that rings up in the uh, sovereign range. Two thousand and two. Oh. Okay, nineteen twenty in the hole. Well, oh. see what we've got. Got a feeling it might be a bit of rubbish, a bit of brass or something. Okay.
all that. I've got a feeling it's something big. Is that it? Yep. Chunk of lead. Big chunk of lead. Well, this rang up as a nice, pretty much solid 19. Looks like it was a silver coin. Oh, nearly dropped it. Here we go. Uh, 1908. Um, something sent. Oh no, it's nineteen oh nine. Something sent. Oh, interesting. It's definitely silver, though. That. And it looks like to be some. Really well worn. Any ideas on that one, guys? Is it an American coin? Is it a trade thing? I don't know. Something different. Okay, same tone, same numbers. I was saying it's a bit deeper. I can see some looks like burnt iron. Well, the ground looks like it's been burnt at some point. Let's have a good pokey on around. Alright, nothing initially standing out, so I think it is going to be deeper. Ground is absolutely rock hard. Uh, I'm hearing a bit of iron in there now. Numbers are a bit all over the place as well. Could be this mixed in with something. Definitely out. Oh, I think I see it. I think I see. Is that? Oh, I can't get my sleeve out here. Uh. Oh, don't tell me that's a penny. Yeah, there's a lot of green there, it's about the right size for a penny. I'm going to say that's a penny. I've not got anything with me to actually clean it up with. Most likely, although weird numbers I don't normally jump up at around there. Okay, I've tried to clean it up a little bit. I don't, you're not going to be able to see this particularly well, but it's a farthing. You can just say A R T H N G. There's the the rent. That is actually my first farthing. <laughs> So I'm quite happy with that, it's, uh, yeah, I'll clean that up when I get home and, but yeah, I'm happy with that, it was my first farthing. Right, I got a screaming 24. Is that it? Yeah. 
Uh, it is a... Throw me a bit, I'll look through it. Yeah. See if I can see a date on it. I certainly see it in the best of... No, oh, better day, should I say. Um, yeah, just trust me that it's a threatening bit. Ah, was a two peat. Well, this was deep. It's a chunk of lead. Hollow. Well, it's round, but it's got something running through the centre that's got like quite a purple tinge to it. Could it be some sort of old battery? I'm not sure. It's definitely got some weight to it. And the lead looks old. But a nice 21. 22. Hoping it's going to be something like an old penny. Of course, it'd be also nice to have something that's going to contribute to the silver challenge. But we'll just have to see what it is. It's a uh, old round pound. Yeah. Okay. So that is. Oh yeah, I said about the um, total inter cash total so far. Uh, so this actually makes it with a uh, nine pound. Uh, I think it's like been nine pound. 80 something so we had a couple of pennies so I'm almost at a tenner well I was just about to give up on this it sounded nice and then it sounded rubbish and then I managed to kind of find it and it's this which actually happens to be a Vauxhall tyre valve cap that's what I'm going to guess what it is looks about the right size yeah. Oh, right. Definitely last signal of the day. Twenty-two, twenty-three. Twenty-three. About there. Nice if it were an old penny. But I've got a feeling it's probably just going to be a bottle top. We can live in hope. I mean, obviously, it'd be cool if it was something else, but for those numbers, it's doubt it. Right. It's out, but it's saying it's aim now. Right, it's getting dark. Hmm. Ah. There we go. Oh, it's even worse. I think it's half a penny. Not a half penny, but half a penny. Bugger, right. Well, that was just a, a short little hunt. A um, lot of tat, couple of coins. I got my first farthing, and I'm going to have to look up what that scent is because, um, yeah, I don't recognise it. It's definitely silver. Um, it's thin, so I'm not sure on that one at all. And I got the first, what were it, 10 euro scent? 
Um, yeah, that kind of had me going for a little minute, unfortunately. But I will hopefully one day find something that's, you know, coin shaped and real gold. Um, but anyway, hope you enjoyed this and I shall see you in the next video. Bye for now.